Oh, we have already seen you, right? Uh, I come in April. Yeah, I've already seen you. Please come, sir. So we've already seen you, right? I think I've already told you uh, every detail about it. No, no, I came alone the last time. My father was there. Oh, so your father. I was not there. Okay. Right. So uh, we need to do uh, a few procedures for him. I have written that he needs septal rhinoplasty, meaning septal work inside, okay. uh, nasal work. His tip is not projected. His bulbous, broad. Here there's a gap and everything. Now, if he wants to have a nice sharp nose, I need to take rib also because we might have to augment this area for support. You see, he doesn't have much support there. You see that? So, which means that we might have to take the rib. This is the only details I've mentioned to him. Uh, seven days stay is needed. You can stay four days at the hospital, then about a few days in the hotel. Come back again for a checkup. We remove the splint, then you can go to Ernakulam, then you'll not have to come back. So, one shot. Seven to eight days, we take care of everything. What else? Any doubts you have, you can ask, I'll answer. Results will be permanent. Um, for the healing, it will take, um, I think, at least one and a half months for him. So, no exercising for one and a half months. He has to take care that he doesn't hit his nose or, you know, some breathing problems might be there for a few weeks because we are also going to do uh, work inside. Um, there is a doubt in English, you can ask me, I can answer you. At least 4 days, you would have stayed in the hotel. If you go to the hotel, you will have to check up. But 4 days, you have to stay here. Because if you have a rib or a major surgery, you will have to get IV antibiotics. But he will be free. You can study online, everything he can do. That's what you can do. You can do everything you can do. Mostly we are going to do it. We don't have support. We don't have anything other than proper. No, nothing. Thousands of missions have done, not hundreds. No, nothing. Yesterday also we have done. You can meet some seven, five patients here who have done in the last one week. No, nothing. In 100 patients, one patient has come to get an infection. That's the matter. But the infection is like a bad thing. The infection is like a bad thing. We don't have a 1% risk of infection. That's not the case. This is the case of 50% risk. The risk is not young. The body is fit. It's not the case. So you want me to do surgery today? Or tomorrow? Yeah, I do. Today is okay? 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 So what time have you... How much time have you done? Morning, sir. Morning, sir. Very good. Now, you don't have anything now. So, we can do the surgery in the evening. We'll tell you the time, 3 or 4, like that we'll do. Hmm? Okay, one last thing. You have any photos that you want to show me? You can look at the idea. Okay, very good. No, no, it'll be very good from now. It'll be very good from now. Some patients, they want to show me something. Just ask if you have made anything. All right. So, just on one second. Yeah, a little bit. So, he has a nose that doesn't have support, you know. This is a classical nose. And this is a South Indian, Asian, Dravidian, whatever kind of a nose you wouldn't want to call. Skin on top is not very thin. It's not that thick also, but still I would call it as a thick skin. It's probably 5 millimeters or so. But we would be able to mold that skin nicely into a nice triangular shape like this. And if you notice, there's less bone here, there's less support in the septum, and it's broad. So like a tent that's collapsed without the support is his nose right now. So once we support the nose from the marginal rim grafts and also the septal graft, it's already going to take a nice shape. And then with the other grafts inside and the osteotomy and the dorsal graft, I think we're going to give him a... A much sharper, elegant, proportional nose for his face. This is our book. Pin and Amal will give you painkillers and all, right? So, there is no pain in that. There is a little discomfort in that because nose is blocked. Pain will not be an issue. Most patients don't complain of pain. Pin and Amal will give you. He can talk, he can eat, he can study, he can call on the phone. He can do everything. 
നോസ് മാത്രം ബ്ലോക്ക് ഉണ്ടാവും വേറെ എന്നാ ഇവിടെ നമുക്ക് വളരെ ഫാസ്റ്റ് ആയിട്ട് മൂവ് ചെയ്ത പെയിൻ ഉണ്ടാവും ബട്ട് ഹി ക്യാൻ ഗെറ്റ് അപ്പ് ആൻഡ് വാക്ക് എവറി തിങ് ദേ ഹിൽ വെരി ഫാസ്റ്റ് യങ് പീപ്പിൾ യു ഡോണ്ട് വറി ഓക്കെ ഹായ് സു വി അബൌട്ട് ടു സ്റ്റാർട്ട് എ കോസ്മെറ്റിക് റൈനോപ്ലാസ്റ്റി ഫോർ ദിസ് യങ് ഹാൻഡ്സം ഗായ് ആൻഡ് ഹി ഹാസ് ഹിസ് കൺസേൺ അബൌട്ട് ഹിസ് നോസ് that is not as pointy as he would desire or as he would want it to so that's what we're going to do for him today in the next few minutes right what are the main concerns for the nose here first main thing as i already mentioned earlier it doesn't have tip support hence it's too broad and flared out is broad here at the nasal level as well the nose is a bit too small for his face so we're going to get the length up by augmenting the radix radix is the place where the nose starts so right from the place where the nose starts we're going to augment that bring it all the way up to the tip increase the projection of the tip increase the pointiness of the tip narrow the width of the dorsum improve the dorsal aesthetic lines and eventually also work a little bit on the alar base by doing that yes it reduces the width but also tightens the nasal labial grooving and would make his face look that much younger that much more fuller that much more without any uh, grooves So this is probably going to take us a little over 2 hours because I'm also planning rib harvest as I already mentioned the support on the septum is very minimal so not only do we have to look at the septum and do a septal plasty but we're doing a septal reconstruction as well for which we would need rib the other area where we would need rib is the radix work and the dorsal work so anyways we're harvesting the rib so we're going to use it for both these purposes and he's going to be with us for 4 to 5 days he doesn't come from very far so he lives in the nearest big city to nagarkoil which happens to be tiruvananthapuram <laughs> yeah it is a tongue twister that's why the british made it trivandrum then but we back to tiruvananthapuram now so that's where he hails from and so with four days time he goes back home and then he's coming back to us after another four days and we'll take off the splint so you can follow us for for that as well and i think he should be happy right <laughs> cosmetic septal rhinoplasty A lot of work on the tip, on the dorsum, also on the ALA base. Rib was harvested. I'll show you how he looks right now. Reconstructed, so to say. Let me show you from other views as well. I'll show you the... Okay, in the front view. And that's the side view. So you can see the how the nose was projected. So we've just completed with this reconstructed septal rhinoplasty so to say because you also had to harvest the rib. So I'm going to show you how he looked before we started. It's taken us almost three hours, two and a half hours. So this was the structure of his nose. It lacked prominence, projection, the radix, tip support wasn't there. The alar base, the columnar to alar relation, the width of the nose, width of the dorsum, dorsal is the decline. All of that was not the ideal. And now we've corrected every bit of that. So from the radix, augmentation tip augmentation tip plasty all kinds of grafts you can think of osteotomies alar base work septal work septal plasty septal harvest rib harvest and that's how much difference we've got for his nose and remember this is a thick skin either dravidian or south indian or asian or whatever skin you might want to call it doesn't have a thin skin It's really hard to mold and get the tip and the proportion of the nose. Mm-hmm. 